if you take a city that starts with a train system, you can encourage development around that train system. That is great for a lower cost living because you don't have to own a car. It's also great for the businesses that might be walkable. There are lots of places where having a car is the standard and where you really can't get from the place you are to the place you want to be. So maybe you have to drive to a place, but then there's that one walkable block where you can go to a restaurant, go to a store, go to the library. More and more cities and more and more suburbs are creating those smaller walkable places, and all of that comes together to create a really vibrant city that can be lower carbon. Mm -hmm.